Hi guys, welcome back. This is episode 56 of the Journeyman Save. I am Woody and uh, it is the 2nd of May 2014. Now, last time I met you, um, our Champions League contention was a little bit up in the air. Our league form's fine. We're still four points in the lead and haven't dropped from that first spot uh, in ages. But obviously, what you're waiting for is the big, big news. Uh, yes, Carlo is Carmelo is still unhappy. Obviously, it's adaptability of two. Got to check that out a bit more often. Um, but what's more important is, did we qualify for the Champions League? Yes, we did. We made the quarterfinals. It was a bit, bit of a given anyway. After we we beat Roma, I think two one was the end. We then uh, we then beat Hanover. Well, we beat we lost we lost to Hanover four one. We got absolutely pummeled. It was an appalling uh, game. It was a European hangover. Once again, if you're playing the uh, cliches bingo at home, um, we drew one all then with 1860 Munich. I got a penalty towards the end there, which kind of did that. Uh, then we came Champions League Group A. And we beat Zurich. Well, we were supposed to. We beat them three now. It wasn't really up in the bag as much up in the air. Sorry, up in the bag, up in the air as much as I had, uh, you know, made it out to be. We then beat Leverkusen four two. What an absolute scracking stonker of a game. They, look at this. They were up two nil. We have a player sent off. I'm like, oh my god. Then they have a player sent off. And then all of a sudden, Miranda Sanchez, Harper, and Eric can just go, you know, you know, you know what? We're not losing today. And they just crack in four goals. What an absolute nuts game that was. Uh, we then beat Sporting 3 2, I think, with a heavily quite rotated side there. Um, we had already qualified by this point, and so we qualified top of our group, which was nice. Um, we then came along and spanked Frankfurt 5-1. Uh, Langella, Tuzelko, Duff, Dijordic and Harper all bagging goals there. Um, and then we had a loss to Nuremberg 2-1 um, with uh, Dahlquist, Gvist, a Swede who's struggling to adjust as well. Adaptability of 9, he's struggling to adjust even before he played a game. Mm. Um, so anyway, we have got Champions League quarterfinals today against Dortmund. Um, also through a Roma, Chelsea, Everton, Leverkusen, and Inter and Atlanta. So three Italian teams, three English, two English teams, and three German teams. No Spanish teams, no French teams. Um, Everton though, crazy. They're ninth in the English Premier League. Um, actually won it last year as well, amazingly. Um, that would be amazing if we played Everton in a semi-finals or whatever. But to get there, we've got to get past Dortmund. Now, <laughs> obviously, because this is how the game works, we've got Dortmund today, then we have uh, HSV, and then we have Dortmund in the league, and Dortmund in the Champions League. So, I don't know how what we're going to do. I'm not sure if I'm going to just do a Dortmund triple header. Uh, Jorge Martinez is a bit tired, so he is just going to move to the bench instead of Ericsson. We're looking pretty good. Um, at a comment as well about Miranda. He's an absolute beast, isn't he? Oh my god, he's so good. I love his to see I love it love his dribbling as well. Finishing 13. He is such a cracking uh, DMC. His adaptability of two though, obviously gonna he's gonna crack it soon and be like, oh I can't live in Germany. Anyway, the who Usiv game. Oh, we don't. We know how we're lining up. Mm. Yeah, maybe we should be playing wide against them, but we're not going to. Mirosov closer on the bench. Thirty-five year old Mirosov closer. Excellent. Right. Let's kick the game off. Here we go. This is huge. Absolutely huge. Get in, Dizalco. And another. Ah, oh, that that's that's amazing. Oh, 
This is a really great start actually. Really, really good. We're all over Dortmund here with Maxim. I got this Al this Alessandro, the Alessandro. Remember the man who left Leverkusen when I joined, then spent all the time sorry, left Juventus when I joined, and then joined Juventus back again after I left. Just he doesn't like me. He's never met me. He just doesn't like me. Let's get the second half back on the way. Dejordic, no, he's just super duper tired. I have been sort of tweaking a bit here. Excuse me about the yawning, it's really late, and um, this is the only time I could record this because I was doing something else. And yeah, no excuses, no excuses. Um, ah, Dominguez. Um, yeah, he just doesn't like me, never met me, and uh, he's like, no, 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 no. Uh, anyway, let's make some changes. Um, let's do this. And let's do this. Oh, that was it. I've been sort of tweaking some, some of the league teams, just obviously because Champions League is has been the priority. Um, so I think we just, you know, it's 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 tough fighting on on more than uh, more than one front, especially when one of them is the Champions League, which we are gunning uh, to win this year. Oh, another goal there would have been great. Um, Oh, and that's what we should also check when uh, when this game's finished is the uh, Real Madrid job status because I'm pretty sure I checked it recently and it's not that good. I mean, good for me. Anyway, that's a good win. They get the away goal, bit of a blow, but um, meh. That's all right. We'll we'll deal with that. Roma spank Chelsea, Leverkusen spank Everton, and Inter and Atlanta draw now. Where are we? Job information. I have a feeling Spain, Real Madrid. Look at this. Slightly insecure. Fourth in La Liga. So I am. Oh, this this is the job that I want next. With Shane Tolley as one of their strikers. I mean, this this is the job I want next. I don't really have. I mean, there's obviously still Casilla. Is Maxi Rodriguez always there? No, he's not always there. Um, I think Kallstrom, obviously. He's not there. Raw Bravo is always here. He's getting on a bit, though. It's 130 games in all that time for Madrid. Crazy stuff. Yeah, so they've, they've lost everyone, really. Um, anyway, that was a good win against Dortmund. Um... I mean, we need to play this other quarter-final game. Probably not going to squeeze the four games in. Um, do we want to go... Do Do you want to see a Dortmund triple header? I know you can't actually answer now because this has been recorded. Um, spoiler alert, I record these, you know, about a week in advance and then put them out, so... Um, but no. What do you reckon? A Dortmund triple header. It sounds a bit boring, but also as well slightly intriguing to see how we play against Dortmund in three head-to-head -head games. <clears throat> Look, I'm back for the uh, HSV game because I thought we'll play it and we'll do we'll we'll squeeze it in. Let's let's go for a four a four gamer and we'll just try and squeeze it in. Where is is Olsen out? He's got a groin strain. Uh, Nyberg's leaving for 1.1 million. He's going to Cottabus because uh, obviously he hasn't adapted to Germany, so he's moving to a uh, a German club. Uh, obviously. Um, all right, we're gonna right bloody right back. I'm just all right. We're gonna play um, play Xavier at right back, and we're 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 just really gonna rest everyone from here on up. Um, right, hold on. Alright, there we are. Changed everyone there. That looks pretty good. Do I might even actually give, because we, is it we? No, we've got some time. We've got some time. That's alright, we'll do this. We'll do this. It's kind of like we're playing a Dortmund ha hamburger. I don't know, some sort of, it's some sort of, because we're playing Dortmund three times, there's some sort of Dortmund hamburger joke in here, but I'll leave that to you guys to, to, to think of something there. Oh, come on, Kim, good stuff. That's what I'm talking about. Are they got Landon Donovan? They do. I didn't even check their team. 
unlike the league, bleh, whatever, come on, we just romp the league again, I think. But let's not get too cocky, you know what happens when I get cocky, uh, I usually start losing games. But, you know, as I keep saying, it is all about the Champions League this year. I mean, winning the league would be nice. Um, I mean, we still got Dortmund nipping on our heels. Uh, I guess Nuremberg is sort of there. Uh, everyone else, else is quite far back. Um, come on, Kim. I'd really like you to stay. I, you know, you look pretty good. Oh, get in Sanchez. I look at this team and I think, who would I take to uh, to Real Madrid if I left? I mean, I don't know. Maybe maybe Schmidt's 28, but maybe definitely Miranda. He is definitely coming. Um, Sanchez, I don't know. Maybe uh, there'd be a couple of guys in here who I would absolutely just take all the time, non-stop, everywhere I go. Um... Obviously, my, uh, my my assistant, Jamie Victory, will come with me. He's a really good assistant, actually. Really, really good assistant. Bouvier. Fabien Bouvier. He could come. I, I like this kid. He's, he's, he's got some skills. We'll see. We'll, we'll see. <laughs> I'll bring along the likes of Jonas London and Martin Eriksson, Igor Tudor, Juice Feleg again. Yeah. Oh, no, don't do that. Uh, cancel. Uh, Juice is actually coming on for Roland Schmidt, who's picked up an injury. That could be a bit of a worry, actually. Um, hopefully it's not too bad, because and he's not out for the uh, Dortmund second leg. That's a really comfortable win there for us. That's good. Good, 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 good. Dortmund won, but yeah. 10 days, that's okay, I guess. Um, Alright, again for the Dortmund game in a week. Dortmund again. And we're back surprisingly for a Dortmund game. Uh, a couple of changes to the squad, mainly we're going, we're going strong here. I know we play them uh, in four days time, but you know, we, we want to win. And I've got too many EU players, Sanchez off the bench. Alright, Dortmund. Nice. Let's kick the game off. Let's beat him again. We've beat him once already. Let's can we do a hat trick of wins against Dortmund? That would be a whoa, cracking episode. Two two out of three games are actually away from home, so um, you know, this is the least important of them. We'll obviously monitor everyone's fitness. Anyone who gets super duper dead, I uh, will take them right off. Hold up. Alright, we're back. I don't know if the video is being a little bit funny there or earlier. If that is the case, I do apologise. I think I fixed it. Um, I think, he says. Hopefully this is a bit better now. I do apologise if there was some issues with the video. Um, made a bit jerky. Oh, Ziki. Pretty even so far, but they have just grabbed one. I say grabbed one back. Ribeiro struggling there at right back. He's getting old. He's 34. 34. He's been a pretty good servant, to be honest. Like I said, this is the game that I can afford to lose. Although, if I lost the other one 1-0, I kind of still um, would qualify for the uh, semi-finals. But, the, there you go. He's having a shocker, so he's faked an injury now to get oh, oh, I'm injured, and we now don't have a right back. Right back for the Champions League game either. It's, Disappointing. We're going to put Summer there for the moment. We might have to play Xavier. He played there last time against um, Ujima Flip. HSV seemed to play pretty well. Pretty tight. Still pretty even, but we just haven't been able to convert our 
a slight chance is. Uh, that's probably it. That's a that's a huge win for Dortmund there. Close the gap to a point. Ouch. Ouch, ouch, ouch. That's wow. Oh my god, it's just going from bad to freaking worse. Uh, I hope this doesn't happen in the other game because that will be gutting as that will be us out of the Champions League. We could, at this point in time, we could bottle both of these. God, that would be... That would be crushing. Why didn't I play Langella? I didn't have him on the bench. You can play this one. Grumble, grumble. Um, Sanchez and... Probably gonna have some tired players, but we'll see what happens. All right, guys, we're back for the third game against Dortmund. Um, how many times have we actually played these guys? I mean, it'd be a lot because you know the games are going for a while. They do have the wood over us. Um, Schmidt and Olsen aren't fit enough. Langell is going to come in at right back. Other than that, very unchanged from the last game because I still think this is our best squad. This is it. This is an absolutely massive, massive game. We lead 2 1 on aggregate. I'll take a 1 0 loss to, at, the, at this point in time. Or a 0 draw. Or any sort of draw. Okay, that's not a good start. I'm so nervous. Get in, Maxim. Get in, my son. Oh, here we go. Half time. I'll take this. I will take this. How's everyone looking? That Duffer's Duffer's probably on his last season as well, actually, isn't he? He's been really good at not as good this year as he was last year, but but still, still pretty good. Metzelda there in defence, he must be getting on as well. Yep, 33, 111 caps. Oh no! It's even now. Oh, we need to bag another one here. No! No, 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 no. Come on, boys. Oh, no, this is... This is all going Pete Tong. Oh no. Oh. Carmelo was poor. This has been treated unfairly. You dumb for the season, mate. Oh, Jesus Christ. When did we get last year in the Champions League? Quarter final again. Oh, my God. Twice in a row. Dumped out the quarterfinals. Who was it last year? Roma. Eventual winners as well. Is that many Dortmund are going on this year to win it? Uh, Inter go through as do Roma. 
And live accusing. Ah. Oh. Oh, this could be. It could be the German. Could be. Could be over. Could be over in Germany actually. Oh, I'm just stunned. Just stunned. Really bold it. This last two games, we've got one, two, three, four, five games left in the season. And we still have a chance of absolutely bowling it against Dortmund. I mean, we do have Munster 18th, Werder Bremen 5th, Bayern 9th, Clone 13th, and Dramstart 16th. So we do have a relatively easy one. It's just Bremen and Bayern who are the tough ones. And Dortmund have got Bayern and Sh oh, very similar run in for Dortmund although they will have the, uh, the Champions League to focus on while well, we don't so gutting so so gutting well you know what? I probably my, <laughs> my plan was to come back and do the semi-finals final the Champions League but obviously that is not happening anymore um so I think what I'll probably do is I'll probably play two games off camera um, and uh, oh, I wonder has has that been drawn yet? So here we go uh, fixtures schedule no not yet um, yeah so I'll probably come back for the Bayern Clone and Dram Start games just because this is so bloody close as well and see if we can win a, another Bundesliga title. So how many goals have we scored? 70, maximum 22. He's miles ahead of everyone. Um, it's John Edge. Great player. Chris Waddle, I think. We, Chris Waddle. Anyway, guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed that episode. Um, I didn't open